as I understand, everyone can post this uh, specific uh, picture now. Well, th th this has been going on for weeks. There was a Norwegian author that posted this picture together with other war photographies and, and Facebook took it away. And that started a public row in uh, Norway about this and a more principal uh, debate. And then two days ago, I, was, uh, I got, received a letter from Facebook uh, asking me to remove uh, this very picture from our page, uh, our Facebook page. And my letter to Mark Zuckerberg today was an answer. I guess it's very difficult for Facebook, isn't it? Because millions of posts go up on Facebook every day and they have to be very careful not to put nude images of children that would be completely inappropriate on the site. Uh, and they won't have the resources or the people to make a judgment over every single image. Uh, that, that is true and Facebook is doing a very good job on uh, preventing child uh, pornography from appearing on their uh, pages and that is good. I'm making a broader point. Facebook uh, has become so powerful now uh, because so much of the information in the world, so much of our communication actually is filtered through their systems that they infect they are becoming editors in chief of a public, uh, public uh, information. And when they do this, li like they did with this picture, not allowing an important image part of our shared history, when they, when they do that, I think it's problematic. And my challenge to Mark Zuckerberg is to come forward, participate in this discussion. I acknowledge it's difficult but he also have to acknowledge that he has to take part in this discussion of how to handle it better.